Today I'm going to show you the progress of a 20 kW generator that we're putting in for a client here in Arlington, Virginia. It's a basic install, but there were some uh, unique little things to get the system where the client wanted it. Hector's going to be unboxing this 20 kW. We'll get it on our little wagon there and we'll take it to the back. That's our parts trailer where we keep everything for generator installations of this size, the smaller ones anyway. And as you can see, we have the meter out. We're doing the power outage today. That hole is where the old service entrance cable did uh, go into the house. He's got his new conduit in there. ATS is mounted. Our surge arresters are in place. We put surge arresters on all of our installs. And the gas meter is right there. A couple of days ago, we had our guys come in and do our trenching for us. And what we do is we have all of our wiring there. As you can see, we've got gas, we've got fiber, we've got drainage, we've got generator wires. It's a pretty busy little area. What we do is we have our guys come in and do what we uh, do on every job, which is mold our projects. So we've mold under the driveway so we don't have to affect the driveway. And so we have our gas line installed. And then down below that, as you can see, the electrical wiring. And then it shoots back here by the garage. And we have all of our wiring and gas in there. And as you notice, we don't have to tear up the entire yard to do this process. So it saves a lot of time and money. There's an older 20 that we put in a few years ago for the neighbor. This client wanted the generator back behind the garage, which is where I recommended to place it so it's out of the way. And we have our pad poured that we poured yesterday. Our gas which is under pressure. Our inspector will be here today. And then our wiring, which is installed, ready to go. We're getting ready to set the generator now. And you can see we had to dig a little bit there. The guys will be back today to backfill, put the yard back in order so we don't have to do anything with that. And they'll be finishing up the install tomorrow. So, nice little three day job. Hopefully you, uh, you like it, you like how we do the work, it stays nice and clean. If you have any questions, give us a call.